Hey, so a couple of years ago, I got the opportunity to work with some former US men's national team players. And they were my colleagues, but they became my boys. And those shows just didn't feel like they came around often enough. We were covering the CONCACAF games for CBS. And we just felt like, man, we need an excuse for this to happen more often. We want to just hang out, talk football. We need a show. And here we are today. CBS has blessed us. So we are very proud to be able to welcome you to our new set and our new show, Kicking It. Hey! <laughs> We're kicking it. There's nothing out there like this. Unfiltered vibes. What makes it unfiltered? You can be as raw as you need to be, bitch. <laughs> Just like being in the locker room, chopping it up with your buddies about the game. Important moves. What? Can I borrow a book? <laughs> <laughs> All I had when I was young is I was fast. I swear. I needed 21 v1 with the goalkeeper to score. Sounds like Charlie. <laughs> <laughs> Was there a game at that 2010 World Cup? For sure, it was like Landon Donovan's goal against Algeria. Honestly. It's killed Clint. I'm sorry. It wasn't that badass goal versus England. It was a <laughs> that was awesome. Can I kick it? You was really pop, lock and dropping in the locker room. Like you were obsessed with that, bro. What do you mean? I wasn't obsessed. I did it one time. Man, you just did it the other day in Vegas, bro. Can I kick it? Can I kick it? Boy named Clint, these haters they got me banned. Everybody know I rap like 50 Cent. Hey. <laughs> Can I kick it? Hey, man, get Charlie out of here, bro. <laughs> Drink. <laughs> you just decided to come say what's up. Yeah, because you guys are good people. So family is family, so hey. you're part of the family. family. Can I kick it? Can I kick it? <laughs> <laughs>